What's going on guys and today I got my slave working for me So today um, I I pay Tommy eight dollars an hour to mop my floors and I make that, that GTR money <laughs> But on a serious note we just pulled this motor it actually went really well There's no damage on um the radiator support and yeah, it's because I'm just like the yeah. Miata pro now, you know I'm anal and was freaking out the whole time <laughs> But I guess if you want to see that, check out his I channel. I guess if you want to see that. I guess. If you guys want to see that, which has been done on YouTube 7,000 times. 7,001 7, now. Seven. Your elbow there. <laughs> Do that again. <laughs> <laughs> so my plan was with the WRX was to keep it, drive it till winter, or drive it in winter, put a hydro on it, drift the hell out of it, and do all this crazy stuff with it. And kind of just like... And <laughs> kind of just like just destroy it and bash it and do all that. That's why I bought this. I bought this to have fun in the winter. But then, then this thing came along. I got this for super cheap, and I just feel way more comfortable like beating up on a car that I literally paid nothing for. Beating up on a car that I learned to build on because this needs a motor. And when I find a motor, we're gonna pull this one and we're gonna put the new one in. Uh, that, I'm not like rushing on this or anything. I'm kind of working on the LS2. This, it just needs to be done before the first snowfall. So I'm like not in any rush on here. But um, a big reason why I'm selling this is my cousin actually needs a winter car, needs an all-wheel drive, and he's been driving around an automatic his whole life, and he said he wanted to learn how to drive standard. So I'm like, look, man, I'll just sell this to literally what I have into the car, then you can have it. So he's buying it, and... Just to make it a little, he's actually buying it for less than I paid for because he doesn't want the wheels. He said, what's the, the cheapest route I can get this car? So we're taking the wheels off. He wants the stock trunk. So I'm going to take the carbon fiber trunk off. We're going to do all that. Um, the power steering's fixed in this, so that's good. And this thing's pretty much ready to go. I just have to plop a radio in it because check this out. I was driving down the highway. And like my Bluetooth kept like kicking out, kicking on, kicking out. And like I was just getting pissed, literally. I went like that. I'm like, oh, piece of shit. Like, eh. and then it just fucking shattered and now it's just broken. So need to put a radio in it today. Tommy has one. He said I can scoop it for 20 bucks. So works for me. We're going to take that out. But the first thing we are going to do is I'm going to take the wheels off. I'm actually very, very excited to see what they look on the Forester. So I got this on the lift. We're going to pop all these wheels off real quick and then jack that up. Just got these wheels off the Forester. And now I guess I'm going to take these fake works off of the WRX. To be honest, this kind of hurts me to see like this car get these wheels. I tried to lean my cousin into just buying the whole car as is because I think it looks just so much better than like what he wants to do with it. Like he doesn't like the two-tone or anything. He said these the wheels don't look that good and well right now he's just trying to get the stock wheels to save money, but I'm very scared to see what it looks like, so here we go. Well, I don't know which where it looks worse, the WRX or the Forester. So, here's the WRX with the stock wheels. Um, I guess it's good that he's getting these wheels because one, he's getting money off. Two, these are good snow tires, so it's a win for him. But I was like excited to see what these wheels looked like on the Forester, and I really don't like them. This looks hideous to me. I'm actually not stoked he's not buying them because now I'm like stuck with these and. This is like a budget winter build, so I'm not going to go out and buy wheels for this thing because that's not the point of this car. The point of this car is to get it running for like under $1,000 and beat the living shit out of it, crash into snowbanks, and rip the hydro. Let's put it this way. The subs in this car are going to be worth more than the car itself. That is my goal here. So I'm going to do the other side now. So this is, this is now, and this was before. Looks way better. Wow. Andrew, you're messing up, dude. Just give me that extra five hundo so you can take these and I can I don't know. I'll I'll just drift with these. I don't care. I think these look better on this car rather than these. Put down in the comments if you guys like these, because I don't. 
All right, so here's the car. I actually ended up doing this yesterday, and I drove this home last night, and I actually have to raise this for my cousin because he's not like fond of like low cars. He wants this a little raised, and this actually rubs, and I'm not gonna give him a car that rubs. He wanted the stock, tr stock trunk on it, so we put it on. The brake light works, everything's good, and it's almost done. I just gotta raise it up, but right now, me and Missile, Missile Miata, we gotta go to um, New York, Long Island to pick up a uh, other race seat for the LS2. The glass guy came today, took the windshield out, and he took the rear trim out so I can replace this as well because it was all gross and stuff. But we're going to Long Island right now. We're picking up the same exact seat for pretty cheap, and it's good, good condition, so very stoked on that. And this thing's coming along tomorrow. Hunter is coming to finish the wrap, so I need to get back here and make sure everything's good. I still need to find a trunk. I'm over the I'm all over the place lately, but we're, we'll make everything happen. So, Missile, you ready, dude? I'm ready. What is this? What is dirt. Dirt. You got some dirt on. Did you. I buy something? I have blow up on the highway. I've Going over the Thrawn's Neck Bridge right now. Um, those assholes took eight dollars fifty cents from me. Not stoked about that, but we're getting Missile's new seat, huh? <laughs> new seat for the Miata. Fuck yeah. Just got the seat, cop this thing for 350 bucks. I think they're 800 new, and I'm way too Jewish to buy an $800 seat. Dude, sit in it. Tell me what you like. Let's see if you like it. I like it because it's like tight. Maybe for me because I'm a little fatter than you, but it's good. Yeah, I mean, it holds me in well. Yeah, it's you're, nice. You're gonna, like, really well. So, I'm stoked on this. Now we have two matching seats. Um, I already ordered the brackets to do it. Ordered real brackets, no eBay shit. Like I said, this is a clean build. We're gonna make this right. So we're gonna go back to the shop and we got some other stuff to do. I still gotta raise this thing. What are you watching, dude? Dude. Imagine if I just hit your camera or your computer. The girl is Timmy <laughs> Tyson, man. He don't play. All right, so. All right. We just got back from the little road trip. Didn't film it just because it's boring. I know you guys don't want to see that, so I didn't film it. And so, they smoked weed the whole time. Yeah, you see my eye? Look at, look at. So oh, yeah. Look how stoned my eyes Look are. how stoked he is. He's super stoked. I wouldn't let him do that in my car. But anyways, <laughs> we got a vape here. Missile, for some reason, I don't know where he came up with this. He thinks he can beat me in a vape off here. We're so, saying that this is a thing. What do you mean? You're, gonna, you're the, judge. the judge. Deal. You're the judge, and then... I guess the commenters can be like, who won? So I'm going first. That's what the judge Biggest does. Cloud. What the Biggest cloud. Biggest cloud. Biggest cloud. If you didn't understand the, the rules, <laughs> you're just like blowing it into a bunch of white. You don't need to stretch. This isn't necessary. Dude, do it till you pass out. You better go hard. I want you to pass out. Do in the same place. It's a good angle. I think he beat you, brother. Shut the fuck up! No I way! I, I think I got him. Put him in the put it in the <laughs> put it in the comments. Oh, that's oh, ultimate disrespect. Oh, put it in the comments. Well, he won. Yeah. He's out. So the WRX is in the air. We got Mitchell over here. Busting ass. He's busting ass. He's wearing his work Me shirt. and um, Spencer just had to run to AutoZone for tomorrow's video, but I guess that doesn't matter. So we have to raise this because it rubs super hard. My cousin wants it a little lower than stock. So I don't really know how much we're gonna go up, but we're probably gonna go up like an inch and a half just so he doesn't have to worry about like any, like any camber because in the snow that doesn't help and he's gonna be driving this in the snow all the time and so it doesn't rub and I don't have to ever do anything with this. So guys, the car is all done to give to my cousin. Here it is, we raised it. It really doesn't look that bad. It looks like more of like a stock WRX and he's getting the car dipped anyway so it's gonna be all one color. And I drove this all the way home does not rub whatsoever. Actually, the ride quality is a lot better, but 
don't be sad that I'm getting rid of this just because I have two, I have two Subarus now. There's no reason to keep both of them. And I much rather sell the more expensive one so I can use the money for the LS2 build. I can use, I just bought a couple things for the Roadster. I still need to buy some SR parts. There's a lot more cool builds going on on this channel that I no longer need this thing. And it's not like I didn't replace the WRX with a Forester because I think the Forester is cooler personally. It's bigger, can fit more subs, and it can still drift and we can still put the ASD in it. So with that being said, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys want to subscribe for more, subscribe for more. Once again, if you're bought hurt, I'm sorry, but I'm a person too. I can sell my cars and that one's a good move to sell because I need the money for other stuff. See you in the next one.